Metallic now supports the broadest selection of Azure databases of any DMAS solution. You can back up both Microsoft SQL Server and Azure databases from the same familiar Metallic hub. It's simple to configure an Azure database for backup. We'll show you how using Azure SQL Server. Once we've done that, we'll also demonstrate how the restore process works. Let's get started. First, log in to the Metallic Hub and launch the new configuration wizard from the databases dashboard. Select Azure Databases. Next, select the database engine you would like to backup. For this demonstration, let's configure backup for Azure SQL Server. Review the topology of your backup method that will be used to protect your Azure databases. Select the region where your database is located. Now select an existing backup gateway or deploy a new backup gateway using the Deploy to Azure option. Copy the metallic authorization code and navigate to your Azure portal. Complete the inputs of the ARM template as per your naming standards. Select the OS version, backup data size, and virtual network. Ensure the selected subnet has outbound internet access so that the backup gateway can communicate with the metallic control plane. Return to the configuration wizard and click on the refresh button to check if the new backup gateway is now available in the list of backup gateways. Select cloud storage for your primary and optimal secondary copy. You can select metallic cloud storage now called Metallic Recovery Reserve, or you can select an Azure storage account from your Azure account. In both cases, the primary copy will be configured in the same region as your database. Next, select an existing plan or create a new plan. A plan is a combination of the cloud storage from the selected region, data retention period, and backup frequency. Now select a cloud account. A cloud account is an Azure app registration or managed identity, which will be used by Metallic to discover Azure databases. Choose the Azure SQL instance from the dropdown list, enter the storage account connection string, and select SQL credentials. The storage connection string is required only for Azure SQL and managed SQL instances. You can use SQL Server System Admin or Azure AD credentials for Azure SQL and SQL managed instances. Backup content in this context means databases running in the Azure SQL instance selected in a previous step. By default, all databases in the instance will be discovered and backed up. You can edit the databases selected later. The configuration wizard ends with a summary of the selected options. You can add another region or click Finish to go to the instance details in the command center. To run a backup job on demand, return to the database instances view and from the action menu of the Azure SQL instance, click on Backup. When prompted to select Backup Type, click OK to continue. This will start a backup job for the selected Azure SQL instance. To view the discovered databases, Go to the default subclient and review the content. Click on Backup History to view the status of the backup job under Active Jobs. Once the backup job is completed, the SLA status on the Azure SQL instance will change to MET. Now we'll perform a restore. Click on the Azure SQL instance and pick a recovery point by selecting a date and time. This will list all the databases discovered and protected in the Azure SQL instance. Select the database that you would like to recover and click Restore. In the Restore Options page, choose a destination instance, which could be the same or a different Azure SQL instance, then select the backup gateway and a staging path. Do not change the name of the database for an in-place restore. In this scenario, we will restore out of place in the same Azure SQL instance. To view the restore job status, return to the job history in the Azure SQL instance view. The restore operation can take several minutes depending on the job. 
The restore operation has now been completed successfully. This completes the demonstration of simplified onboarding, backup, and restore operations for Azure SQL databases. Together, Microsoft and Metallic are committed to helping customers protect their business critical data, all while leveraging the latest cloud technology with an agile SaaS delivered solution built with the power of Microsoft Azure.